Uh, I mean, I, I felt pretty good. I think the uh, biggest focus was I mean, I pitched against him in the fall, threw all fastballs for him, I'm pretty sure. So it kind of mix and match him. Yeah. Were you itching at the bit to get like more innings than uh, the first two outings yet? Yeah, I mean we've we've worked extremely hard uh, for me just to be able to pitch and feel good. So we're at the point now where I think we're able to do that consistently. Um, so just building off this uh, will be great. Seems like you uh, leaned pretty heavily on that sinker, right? Yeah, I I don't know if it's a sinker, uh, lucky <laughs> not, but uh, I mean yeah, I think. Uh, for me, it was mostly just commanding three pitches. I don't even sure if it's a change up yet. Um, but yeah, the, the four scene was, was pretty good. Yeah. How have you felt? How do you feel right now? How have you felt after that? Good, yeah. Like I said, we've, we've worked extremely hard um, to build my body up for this, and I think going forward, it's going to be good. So yeah, it's all good. Good confidence building for you? Yeah, I think uh, having the bullpen like Gigi and then uh, Bourne to come out and finish the game off like that was, was amazing. So uh, it was a lot of fun. Thank you. Yeah, just preparing for tomorrow. Um, just keep attacking the zone, suffocating the hitters. Um, I think we've done a pretty good job of that so far with uh, yesterday and today. Um, so just keep it going and then focus on the game tomorrow. Are you kind of seeing what this team is trying to get for? Yeah, I think we are showing it a little bit um, on the pitching side of things. I think the offense is going to get going for sure. Uh, but as a pitching staff, I think when we're attacking hitters, our stuff is, is elite. So um, for all of us, it's really confidence in going on. They're characterizing as that's a two-seam fastball. It's a four-seamer. Um, I think it just had a lot of uh, time today. Uh, I'll go back and look, but uh, I thought it was pretty pure. I think with, with anyone, I mean, I, there's a lot of people on the same page. So I uh, think Hawkeye or whatever it is might just like run a little more and call the same page, but uh, it's a four-seamer. And I asked that because there's also, you're also going four-seamers, but most of those pitches were just your fastballs. On yeah, they were all the sinkers and four-seamers, just four-seamers. Okay. Uh, maybe I was going to sign of it. Is this the kind of performance you envisioned while you were rehabbing and trying to get back? Yeah, I mean, I always envisioned myself to pitch like that. Um, I think there was a lot of positives, but still there's, there's things I need to work on. Um, so just building off that. So you like the chain? Yeah, I mean, I'm happy to wear it. Uh, I'll pass it on to someone tomorrow. But uh, yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, we don't. I think, uh, see the season? Yeah, we'll probably name something in a couple weeks. Maybe. How have you improved since you came to LSU? Uh, I think mentally, just knowing uh, as a whole and collectively, like our stuff is, is really good. Um, so just going at guys, I mean, that lineup is pretty good, but um, our stuff is, is better than theirs. So just really going at guys and attacking them. What Hayden, uh, what makes him a tough guy? Hayden? Uh, I mean, he's, he's a big guy. I think uh, the zone plays into it and uh, he hits everything. I mean, he's going to hit mistakes with, with that for sure. So. Um, with him, you kind of have to get out of the zone and make a chase, but he's, uh, he's really good. What's the goal today to get to 75, 76 ish, -ish pitches as you ended up getting to? Yeah, I think uh, it was 70, somewhere around there, uh, kind of seeing how it felt. And uh, yeah. Is the goal to get even more to 80, 90s? Yeah, like just yeah progressively, yeah. like I said, uh, building up today will we'll increase it. Um, I still have to talk to Coach about that, but. Um, yeah, we're still going. Do you expect to start today? Uh, yeah, yeah. You guys have a lot of arms in the bullpen, a lot of lefties. How do you kind of pick who goes in when? Um, I think that's more of a, a coach's answer. Answer, but uh, I mean, there's a lot of depth. I mean, like Lore, he's got that. He's got a sinker. I mean, I think they wanted to change it at one point because it has so much, so much horizontal on it. Um, and then you got Ackenhausen, Javen Coleman, Anderson. I mean, all these guys are different in their own ways, but the stuff is so elite and the mentality of them is to go at hitters. Uh, so, I mean, they could pick anyone, to be honest. Yeah, we didn't stick to our plan with the, the starter. Um, he was able to take advantage of our aggressiveness early in the game, and I think it backfired on us. Um, and, yeah, I'm just learning to be more patient the more I got more to get. Um, I'm not always going to get what I want, so just filtering what they throw and what I like and go for it. Yeah, I'm glad it's 315 over there. <laughs> boy, oh boy. And what sort of change in the fifth inning for FC?
Um, just mentality. Like, we knew they were, were going to crack. Um, it's just how it goes. Our goal is to get them out far before that. It didn't happen. Um, so you got to adjust on the fly. And It's not something we didn't expect. Um, we knew it was Arsenal, we knew it was stuff he had. I just, we didn't stick to what we were good at like we did um, yesterday. We stuck to our planning, it worked out well. The team's favorite, we just didn't do that today. And uh, we stuck to it. Did you expect this kind of a start from Gage? Yeah, I told you all a few weeks ago he's good. I don't know if y'all didn't believe me, but he's a great pitcher. Um, yeah, I looked up at one point, he had 60 pitches and like 15 balls. So yeah, he's, he's pretty decent. What makes him so tough to, to hit? Uh, so imagine, I don't, I'm not a metric guy with pitching by any means, but I've been told it's like typhoid heater for the left side. So it's a really good right heater, and then he's got three pitches to go off that. But I think the biggest thing with him is he wants to win. He wants to compete. That's why he came here, because he wants to win. Um, you can hear it when he's in the dugout with the guys, um, backing his teammates up, and he, go, he goes up there and gives it all. Can you see the team get a little bit better? Yeah, absolutely. We have a lot of room to go. Yeah. Um, we're such a young team, a lot of new faces in the lineup. We're gonna learn, we're gonna learn as we go, learn to mesh and take up bats off of each other and just pass the stick to the next guy. There's weird things happening now, like the dropper right there. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, I mean, but is Jay really good about like using those things and kind of about beating you up, but make sure you understand? Yeah, I mean, it's only failure if you look at it in that sense. There's always room to improve, room to grow, and uh, that's what excites me most about this team is we're not close to what we can do on a full scale. Um, whether that be the staff, they've had some really great outings, but on the offensive side in particular, we're not close to what we're doing. It's one of those things, just you know, just sticking to that plan, sticking to that approach, even if you're going up against a guy with you know, why not be throwing 95 out there? Sure, but that, I mean, that's the cat and mouse baseball, right? Um, we were too aggressive, he feasted on that early. So I think I think just having faith in ourselves, and you know, Coach Cole's a panic kid, and um, you see a lot of chasing and stuff like that. So. Just, you know, there's no need to feel panic from the box. It's your box, and uh, just stick to what you need. That, that meeting with the pitchers just over there, what was that sort of about? Um, there was a lot of stuff. I, I can't really But just doing your job. Justin did a great job tonight. Griffin did a great job. Didger came in, backed up Griffin when he really needed it. Um, and then obviously Gage did what he's capable of. Are you enjoying getting the focus on designated hitting, but more than catching this year? Yeah, I like it, I, but I like catching because it's the the battery aspect of it. So being able to work with a pitcher, um, it's one of my favorite things with the sport because you have a lot of impact, whether it be with body language, um, help pitchers make adjustments between innings. So yeah, I like it. I think it helps my body stay a little fresher, not with the foul balls and all that stuff. But I like catching. It's a fun fun sport. Do you think that home run the seventh was going out, or is it going to be close? I know I had a chance. Um, I know I got enough barrel on it. I just it went up high. Uh, thankfully. The wind's kind of pushing the left, so got a little boost from that. How much did the patience that you had to do throughout your feet kind of help turn you the Um, I think I've always been a good hitter. I just got in my way a lot. Um, whether that was trying to do too much, I love to try to hit homers for the first few years of my career. And I would turn out not hitting homers. So um, the more I the more I play, the more I learn about myself, and I'm able to uh, apply information that I do learn. So. I think um, it's given me no reason not to trust myself. And my focus when I come here is just to have fun.